you're not tied down anymore time to move on please scroll on if this doesn't resonate and let go of your fear this i swear to you this is like the same exact energy keeps coming through and i have so many cards here that i could have chosen and this let me move on keeps coming out like your spiritual gifts are why you need to be guided away from this i think that you kept yourself stuck in a situation way longer than necessary and you know that i, I don't i kind of think it happened gradually you went along to be nice that's what i mean like the same energy keeps coming through you went along to be nice and just found yourself in a bad situation you know behavior got became expected you know what i mean like when you don't put up boundaries with certain people right away they will walk all over you and I think that's what you learn from this. You have nothing to fear going into your next situation. If it's a job, relationship, whatever it is, you just need to trust that you have very strong spiritual gifts. You're very, very strongly spiritual gifted. And this has really, really been a long time coming. Your fear is what's kept you there. Let me pull a few more cards. Third party, it feels like you always slip away. Name two things you're grateful for right now. Lesson learned. That's what I mean. Like, I just, didn't I just mention that? That that's what you learned from this was that you don't, you can't keep going along with people. I just think, wow, I'm getting a sense that you really ended in some kind of despair here. Like, something about the third party, I don't think this was a bad thing. I think a third party had to come along. I think maybe you were swayed away by a third party. But that's not always a bad thing. Sometimes the third party, look... I'm not trying to say it's good if you left a marriage or anything like that. Look, only you know your situation. What I mean is this had to happen. You weren't you weren't where you were supposed to be. I'm going to just put it to you that way. You slipped away because you had to. The main thing you need to get from this is to really think about what you've learned. I, I just think there's a lot of fear that there's going to be some repeating of old lessons. And no, you've learned. You have learned part of that has to do with naming what you're grateful for i think if you really it says name two things you're grateful for right now but really name more than that just really start thinking about what you have that's good because you have so much to build on that's why we make gratitude lists and lists of things we that are positive because it's it forces us to look at the positive instead of the negative and it's a time that you really need to look at the positive because there's so much you need to not look at anything negative everything negative is going on for a reason to bring in the positive it's time to move on you have moved on that look let this resonate for you i'm not really sure i think this could mean different things for different people a third party came in i think maybe the other person left you for a third party but i just let you know whatever happened to make this end it was supposed to happen be grateful be grateful i know it might not seem that way now but be grateful this happened because this had to have this had to come to an end let's speak some good things into your life oh that flipped right over for a reason you said healthy boundaries that's what the fear is that you're going to get into another situation or that maybe you already think you have where someone's going to run all over you and you know not let you have boundaries but no you said healthy boundaries this time that's what you've learned that's what you were going to take into the next situation job whatever it is relationship you are an original um maybe somebody tried to copy you they tried to really beat you down over thinking that they were the brains of the operation they were not you were you're you were the original you're the one who gets copied not them you, it's you not them you naturally command respect that's what i'm saying this person really was disrespected you you did the right thing you naturally command respect and you deserve it it is spoken it is written and so it is amen